Um, let's talk about Cardi B, Birdie B. Not not making any music because she's writing. She's another one influencer, influencer. One of the biggest influencers in the game. Not really a rapper. Raps on the weekends. She raps more than Sweetie, but they're both part time rappers. Um, Cardi B's not really even a rapper. She doesn't write. She's just an influencer. She's writing off Nicki Minaj's brand. She's just she's just Nicki's rival. She's that's all that's all her purpose is. Her purpose is Nicki's rival. You know, they felt like, uh, it, 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 I guess they felt like, okay, Kim is Kim is dying and, you know, in the gutter. I hear Ice Spice, you know, pretty bitch, but I came from the gutter. No, okay, honey, little Kim is really in the gutter, not you. And I really, I mean, look, I really, I don't know about little Kim. I just, she's okay. I, I, I respect her for what she did for female rap, but she's another one who doesn't write her own music. And she's just a mess. She's just turned into a mess. I really feel bad for her. I don't really like her music. It's way too sexual for me. But, you know, I'm wishing Lil' Kim the best. But, you know, she's, she's, I guess because she's so far in the gutter, they just felt like, okay, she's really not competition or she's really not a rival for Nicki anymore. You know, she's, you know, Nicki Minaj has successfully slayed that dragon. So now we need, you know, more ops. And so here we have Birdie B. But, she, the music doesn't stick. The Grammy was fake, you know, and all scripted. You know, it was done to slight Nicki Minaj, as we know. It's all about, she's just another, she's just a puppet. Cardi B is a puppet. She only got her deal to beef with Nicki Minaj. Now, I guess part of, there was a clause in there, you're going to turn into Nicki Minaj. I don't know. But the music isn't sticking. She doesn't have talent. She's... She should just go into TV. Like, I liked Cardi B before she started beefing with Nicki. Like, when she was on Love and Hip Hop, I fucked with Cardi. But once she started all this Nicki beef, I never fucked with her music. That's, but that's, that's on God. Like, I never fucked with her music like that. You know, Bodak Yellow is cool. But, um, you know, Bickenhead is okay. But I don't like Cardi B's voice, you know. So I really don't, I don't like, she, she doesn't speak English or Spanish that well. And it comes out in her voice. And she has a heavy tongue. So I don't like the way she raps. So and she raps all hard and deep. I, she sounds like she's trying too much. I don't like it. Um, so I'm not a fan of her music. But I was a fan of her, you know, she's an influencer. I was a fan of, like, her personality, her being an influencer before she started trying to rap and started trying to beef with Nicki. She's another one. She shouldn't be rapping. Cardi B would have been A-okay if she could have just, like, kept doing acting stuff. She should have used Love and Hip Hop to break off into um, bigger acting gigs and like be, you know, have a comedy show or something, you know. And her and Offset, they're going to end up doing reality TV because their careers are both sinking. Mark, mark my motherfucking words. Her and Offset, they're not going to be rapping too much longer. Both their careers are in the can. No one's thinking about them. They are not going to be around much longer. Not not rapping. They'll both move on to acting and more deal. They're 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 gonna be fucking influencers. Like as long as they do their rituals and 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 stay in line, they'll be phased out of rapping. And <laughs> Cardi B should be phased out of rapping in probably the next eighteen months. Um, Offset, get, I give it three years and he'll be done with rapping. Quavo's another one about to move to acting. So it's all over.